my friends, uh, we're gonna do some more clock work this week. So I made a clock out of a paper plate. You can do this as well. You just take a paper plate. We talked about where the 12 goes on top, the six on the bottom, the three and the nine, and then you fill it in. All right, so it goes from one all the way back up to 12. Right here, I have a long hand and a short hand all at 12. So this is 12 o'clock. If I change this, like this. You remember, the long hand tells us what? Remember, the minutes, the short hand tells us the hour. So if the short hand's on three, and the long hand's on 12, it's three o'clock, okay? Now, as the long hand goes, the sh short hand goes, moves as well, but slower. So if we were to say 3.30, Remember, the short hand is going to be between three and four, all right? Because it's after three, but it's not yet four. So anytime you see the small hand between numbers, you always think it's the smaller number. You're going to jump back, okay? You always go backwards. You look backwards. So let's say... What time is it? That's right, six o'clock. Anytime the long hand or the minute hand is on the 12, it's o'clock. Anytime, we'll put it down here, the big hand is on the six, it's 30 or half past. You can say, this is between seven and eight. So it's 7.30 or half past past seven, right? Because one full time around is 60 minutes. Half of that is 30 minutes. So we say half past. One whole hour goes around once for the hour. All right? So you are going to make up a clock like this out of a paper plate. Any kind of paper plate will work. I use, um, what are these? These are pipe cleaners. You can use anything you have handy. I just poked a hole in it and then I put it in the back. So what I did is I took my marker, start with 12 on the top and go straight down to six. Then you go with three and you go straight across at nine and then you fill them in, okay? Then I took my pencil and I put a hole right in the middle, one little hole and I did that way. If you don't have pipe cleaners, maybe um, I was thinking of using these and you would color them different colors. So you know the different colors because they're the same size. So if I colored, or you could put like an H on one for our hand. I'm gonna put a big H on one because that's an hour hand. And then a M, minute hand. Okay, so if the hour hand is on we're gonna put the hour hand on 10 and the minute hand is on 12 it is 10 o'clock okay it'd be the same as this all right have some fun do that there's also an activity um, in your packet where you are going to write different times for what you do like in the morning you can write um, in the morning, I usually get up, well, when I get up with my husband sometimes, and he gets me up super, super early. He gets me up at 6.30 on the days he has to go to work. He gets me up at 6.30, right, half past six, so we could go walking. So we take our walk in the morning before he goes to work. Um, on the days he doesn't go to work, we wait till about, we get to sleep in, wait till about eight o'clock. So we get up at eight o'clock, we go for a walk. So when maybe you get up at eight, maybe you are lucky and you don't get up till nine o'clock. So on your, it has a piece of paper. You don't have to print it out. You can just tell someone or write it down at nine o'clock, I get up and I have breakfast. I usually have my lunch at about one. 
I'll eat lunch at about one o'clock. At four o'clock, I go swimming. Because I can't go when it's super, super hot and super sunny because I burn. So I have to wait till it gets a little bit later and the sun's not so hot on me. But at six o'clock, I have dinner. So what time I have dinner? And then at nine, around nine, maybe sometimes 10, 10 o'clock I go to bed. All right, so you're gonna tell me three times, something you do in the morning, some things you do maybe in the middle of the day, maybe you go for a bike ride, maybe you go outside and play, you know, whatever it is that you do. And then at night, maybe it's dinner, or maybe it's a walk at night you do, or something that you do at night, okay? Uh, one more thing I want to show you is when we are writing times down. I have to get some paper. Here we go, paper. So when we're writing times, show you my paper here all right so let's say I get up in the morning I get up at 6 and then 30 this is my hour and this is my minutes right and that's my cuckoo clock there's one there's two there's three there's four Oh good, it's four o'clock, it's time for me to go in the pool. But I will write that down right here. My cuckoo clock reminds me to stop working and to take a break and go swimming. I swim, so that's at four o'clock. It also has a clock and you're going to write. So remember 12 is up here, three, six, and nine. Right, so at four o'clock is right here. So I'm gonna put my short hand and my long hand. Okay, that's four o'clock. At 6.30, I walk. And here's my clock, you just make a circle, put a dot in the middle, okay? Put your 12 up top, six below, three and nine. Okay, that's 6.30. So my big hand is down here on the 6, and my little hand is between the 6 and the 7. 6.30. And then I'm going to do 1 o'clock is lunchtime. Now this is a.m. We say this is a.m. This is morning. This becomes p.m. It's afternoon. And this is p.m. Right? I don't eat lunch at 1 a.m. because that would be in the middle of the night. I eat it at 1 p.m. Here's my clock. There's my dot. I'll put my 12 and my 6, my 3, and my 9. 1 o'clock, so it's o'clock. My large hand is up here on the 12, and my small hand is right there on the 1. Okay? So you're going to be doing some of that. You can get a regular piece of paper and do it just like this. You don't need to print anything out, all right? You could use a whiteboard. You could go outside and do it in chalk outside, all right? You could do it any way you want with any tools you have, okay? Just because I give you a worksheet doesn't mean you gotta do it on the worksheet, all right? And then it asks you, what's your favorite time of day and what do you get to do, all right? Maybe your favorite time of day is after dinner because you get dessert. Or maybe it's in the morning because you get free time and you can go outside and play. Or in the afternoon when you get to go swimming like me. Whatever it is, whatever reason. Maybe it's art time. Maybe it's calling grandma and grandpa. Okay, whatever you get to do is your favorite time. All right, that's time, my friends.